All right, how you doing, folks? This is gonna be a quick uh, Thursday update for all of next week. I will be working and doing some stuff, and I'm gonna release the uh, all the prizes, the big three prizes. I got my last of the mail that came in. Uh, I got two more tickets. One from Los I think. What was it? What was it? But it's the first time I've gotten a dollar money gram. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna put that in my scrapbook. Then I got five dollars from Manic Mark. Take all the dollars and I'll add a number to them and aspire who has a ticket. And then I'm going to write them on saltines here. Write the number down on the saltine with a marker. And then uh, I have a little. That's how we're going to choose the competition. But that won't be released until next week, so just stay tuned. And this uh, coming Friday, if when the Friday the 10th work gets put out on eBay for one week and it all stops on Friday 13th. So let's let you so Justin's already flown the coop. He's out of here. And so I have to uh, come up with some new, you know, there's been a new guy stepped in, a new folk artist that's stepped up. He's real talented. You know, I can sense it. He contacted me. He's been watching my uh, videos and whatnot and trying to figure out what I'm doing. And he cut a really good video. His, I'm going to give a little link down to his channel down below. You also check him out. Well, I wanted to take a minute, pause, and thank Chicken George because without him, I wouldn't have tapped not even an umph degree of my talent. I think he ignited my fire. Because of him, we got. Um, he's a really good dude. You know, he's he has a real good. You know, he said his mother was an artist, and, was, and she was talented, and he knows if he just works hard enough, he can become one. And, uh, we got Chips Ahoy. We got Rage of the Red Dress Woman. Uh, and we got this one, this unfinished piece. I'm going to finish it which I had no idea what I'll name it but maybe I'll wait until I get to Redford I might not even paint this one I might give this one to Ruby so she can fill in the lines you know she's pretty good at that <laughs> but he knows how to he just puts his soul in the right place. He can make some wonderful genius works, and seems like he's doing a good job already. You know, because that one, I think I'd done the sketch. You know, she knows the colors. I'd like to do a co collaboration with her. Um, so, you know, I wanted to thank you for that. I'm sure Justin has thanked you over and over again. Before. You know, without you, he would have, who would he have been? I don't know. Wouldn't have been an artist at all. He'd probably still be in, in a truck. You know, you lit his fire. Ribby, I, nobody ever saw where she was before, before she met you, you know. So, you know, you are the catalyst of talent. And Redford is the location, and you are the teacher. You are the master. That's why you got that master's degree, I imagine. You know, you know what you're doing. So, I want to thank you. I'm looking forward to coming out there real soon. I'll be out there real soon, and imagine what I can crank out with that kind of... That kind of primordial soup of talent out there. I hope I don't become the object of Ruby's rage, though. No, sir. Well, I'll see you soon. I just want to support, you know, my fellow YouTubers and YouTube characters out there, and that's why uh, his name is uh, Cooper. And uh, I give you major bravos. You know, here I'm, I'm Chicken George is here to back you all the way. 
to Justin ain't here anymore. He went ran off to another town and all I got is freaking psychopath Ruby here to deal with. 